Hi everyone, this is a quick video as an introduction to acids and bases. So what are we going to be learning? So you should be able to define acids and bases, identify common acids and bases by their name and formula, and explain the pH scale. So first of all, let's uh, look at the definitions of, of acids and bases. So acids are substances that release H plus ions, that's hydrogen ions into water. That forms an acidic solution. Examples of common acids, these three you have to know for year 11 in both name and formula. So hydrochloric acid, sulfuric acid, nitric acid. Bases are substances that contain OH minus ions when they form a solution. So OH minus ions, those are called hydroxide ions. Um, bases neutralize acids and vice versa. Now, the ones, the common bases that you have to be able to recognize, you don't have to know their name and formula specifically, but you have to recognize metal hydroxides, for example, sodium hydroxide, potassium hydroxide, metal oxides, so magnesium oxide, for, for example, and metal carbonates. Those are really common too. Sodium carbonate, magnesium carbonate, calcium carbonate, copper carbonate, and so on. Ammonia, less so. Now, let's move on to the pH scale. So, most acids are uh, colorless liquids, so they essentially look like water. Um, so it's very hard to tell whether it's an acid, a base, whether it's a very strong acid or, or, or otherwise. So we have a scale that helps us to um, indicate to us on what's, uh, how strong of an acid or base it is. So our pH scale goes from 0 to 14, with 7 in the middle, 7 being neutral. Uh, any number less than 7 is acidic, and the most acidic is down at 0. So if you have something that's a pH of 6, 5, 4, something like that, it's going to be only slightly acidic, and down here is going to be very acidic. Uh, when we're talking about the opposite side of things, base, we've got something that's very, very basic is down at 14, and then uh, only slightly basic is closer to 7. Um, you'll see the word alkalinity here. Alkalines are bases that do dissolve in water. Okay, so that's our little uh, finish there. Um, make sure you watch the other videos for the next bits of content. Thanks.